During a major sporting event, such as the NFL Super Bowl, the power supply companies are anxious. That's because, during a commercial, millions of refrigerators trigger simultaneously, causing massive spikes in the energy demand. Human behavior and changes in environmental conditions are responsible for the temporal correlation. In buildings, the heating, ventilation, and air conditioning systems operate independently of each other and frequently result in temporarily correlated energy demand surges, or peaks. Electric utility companies charge based on the peak power consumption, and the price charged for peak power is often 200 to 400 times the nominal rate. Therefore, peaks in power consumption are not only operationally inefficient, but also very expensive. En route is an energy router for peak power reduction in buildings. It reduces peak power consumption by coordinating energy demands from multiple systems and ensures systems operate within their specified thresholds. The testbed is a scaled model of a building with four zones. Each zone has a heating element and a cooling element. Sensors monitor the temperature level inside each zone in real time and report the data to the gateway which acts as the energy router. The gateway monitors the total energy consumption of the building using a non-invasive current sensor. Using the data from the sensors, the gateway schedules each zone to either heat or cool while ensuring that no two zones simultaneously consume power. The building model is kept inside a larger enclosure which simulates the outside environment conditions for the building. The dashboard displays the state of each zone, the status of the wireless sensor actuator network, and the real-time energy consumption of the building. During initialization, the user can set the operating points for heating and cooling. The operating points control the brightness level of the bulb and hence the heating capacity of the zone. When the zones operate in an uncoordinated manner, you can observe spikes in the total energy consumption. On the other hand, the peak power drops significantly when the energy router coordinates the switching using a lazy scheduling algorithm. The peak power with the lazy scheduler is 40 to 50 percent lower than the uncoordinated case. The testbed is being used to develop a new class of scheduling algorithms for cyber-physical systems, such as buildings.